as a commitment to sustainability and carbon neutrality, American University's goal is to send zero waste to landfills and incinerators. This means two options for waste management on campus, recycling and composting. Currently, organic waste, waste stuff relating to or derived from living matter, makes up 45% of our campus waste. Despite our goal of zero waste, American University currently sends contaminated organic waste to landfills. Up until this past year, we sent our organic waste to a locally operated composting facility in Prince George's County. So, what changed? Contamination levels in AU's compost exceeded those allowed under the facility's zero contamination tolerance policy. This is where we need your help. We need the university community's full participation to ensure our waste is entirely sorted so we have a non-contaminated waste stream. Though your decision to throw away a candy wrapper or compost a cup from the DAF may seem insignificant, you're the most important factor influencing our success. American University will start composting again with organic waste from TDR and the DAF's coffee grounds in the spring of 2016. As buildings reduce their contamination, AU will be incorporating clean organic waste streams to be composted off campus. This is why your participation is so important. Luckily, it's a simple task. The key is understanding what products go in each bin, and most importantly, what don't. Let's start with what can be put in the bins. All food waste can be composted, and we really mean all. Dairy, deli, seafood, bread, frozen food, meat, bones, poultry, produce, eggshells, coffee grounds, even tea bags. Wow, that's a mouthful. But that's not all. You can compost wood-based products and paper-based materials. You can compost wet or soil cardboard and wet or soiled paper. And of course, you can compost any items that are labeled compostable. Usually these products are found in MGC or the DAV. Now let's talk about the most important topic, what can't be put in the compost bins. The biggest issue is glass. It is important to leave glass out of the organic waste bin because when this waste is sent to a composting facility, glass can break and be incorporated into the compost. Similarly, plastics and metal are not organic and don't degrade in the composting process. Both can be accepted in our green plastic metal glass bin. By correctly sorting your waste on campus, you can help us continue to compost. Let's work together to reach our zero waste goal.